Double X-Wing fans, this is Jay Buzzsaw 79 I apologize in advance, I still have not gotten my camera fixed or bought a new one. Uh, so I'm doing this with my iPad once again, so I will try to stabilize as much as possible here. Uh, we're going to get right into the build here today, uh, without much time being wasted. This is what I'm calling Ladies Night Out. Uh, this is the Imperial version, so we're going to start right over here. Alright, so first up for Imperials, I, I love Countess. She reminds me of my Poe Dameron um, for Imperials, I guess. Uh, I run her with what you see there, the Push the Limit uh, Twin Ion Mach 2 to clear away and make those maneuvers green. Uh, with, of course, the uh, tie X title, uh, Countess herself with the 5 pilot skill, 3 attack, 3 defense, 3 hull. Uh, three shields, a lead cannon missile, but that doesn't matter because the title. Uh, focus, target lock, barrel roll. Uh, when you reveal a straight maneuver, you can treat it as a K-turn for her. So she is the first up in this build. Next up, Duchess. Uh, this is kind of the first time I've used the uh, striker, really. Like, really use the striker. Uh, once the Duchess was announced, I kind of really wanted to run her with the Countess. So I'm running her with her title on, so that way, uh, technically it says you have to do the one bank forward or bank right the other way. Uh, but according to Dutch's ability, you can choose to ignore that uh, if you want. So basically, it's essentially her boost then at that point. Uh, I put adaptability on her to bring her PS up to 9. So she has a 3 attack, 2 defense, 4 hull, no shields. Uh, with the Elite Slot, which we're taking up with the Adaptability, Focus, Burrow Roll, Evade, uh, and of course the Lightweight Frame to uh, make her 3, 3, 4, 0, uh, 9, so that way kind of she's a, uh, a weird version of an Interceptor, I guess, to me. And finally, to bring it up with the last one here is my Whisper. And uh, basically what I've done with Whisper here is kind of cut down. I removed the VI. And replace that with adaptability, so she's only at 8. Um, what that allows me to do is keep the collision detector on, advanced cloak, and my favorite, the recon specialist, because I just think that's a hell of a lot better than not running anything else. Uh, this build is a 100 points on the head right now. So there you go, the three ladies for the Imperials. Uh, tell me what you think. Um, you like it? Don't like it? Um... What would you change? Uh, this is kind of what I'm going to be running as one possibility for my regionals list. And uh, so, yeah, if people want to give me some thoughts on this, uh, I'd be most appreciative. I'll have some other lists coming out shortly for the uh, regionals list that I have. Uh, some of them are going to be, I think there's one more Imperial and like three Rebel and several after that that are going to be for the... Uh, uh, scum factions so all right uh, thumbs up if you like this thumbs down if not comments always welcome and as always if you have time and don't mind us please feel free to go ahead and drop me a subscription in there all right all right thank you much this is jay buzzsaw 79 signing off